The Asian Financial Forum 2017 covered many aspects of innovative financing coming to the fore, including a panel on the prospects and challenges of infrastructure financing. Kyra Kellenbetoff of the Astana International Financial Center joins us right now, and thanks very much indeed for joining us at the uh, AFF 2017. Looking really at um, where the Astana International Financial Center is going, it's opening in 2018, but in the lead up to that, what are you expecting? This year we have to prepare to establish new institutions like Independent Financial Court Arbitration Center, and what is the most important, all the legislation and regulation would be based on English common law. So it means that Kazakhstan, in terms of AAFC, will join to the English common law jurisdictions family. How much interest has there been in the center so far? I think uh, in our part of the world, if you see that between uh, London and Warsaw, Dubai from one side and Hong Kong and Beijing from the other side, there is no uh, very strong uh, financial services regional uh, hub. So that's why I think that uh, Astana International Financial Center can compensate this. We are in Central Asia market, 70 million plus uh, Eurasian Economic Union is uh, another 200 uh, million people. So a good market for to establish regional financial services hub. And the English financial idea, and certainly in the legal background that you have to that, of course you have something in common with Hong Kong. Yes, we study uh, the successful cases from Hong Kong, uh, how the stock exchange is working here, or how uh, big and rich uh, uh, financial services community and we would like ex actually to uh, also create something like this in, in, in Astana. You expect actually there to be a great deal of cooperation between Hong Kong and Astana as well? Sure, I think that uh, first of all there is no uh, any kind of conflict of interest or area of competition. The geography is completely different but the idea is the same, like to service to the greater China uh, economy uh, and I think the, the entire Kazakhstan economy can be service economy to the Chinese market to the Asian market from one side AAFC can be kind of good platform so where the people immediately can understand each other in which jurisdiction in which platform in which particular business opportunity they are working one immediate idea that comes to mind is of course the Chinese initiative Belt and Road because Hong Kong could be connected to that but also you would see Astana as the other connector in your part of the world. Absolutely. Uh, uh, Kazakhstan, uh, among other two, uh, among three countries, including Pakistan and Iran, was chosen by the Chinese government like a key country for implementing the idea of One Belt, One Road. In fact, the President Xi announced his idea in Kazakhstan in Nazarbayev University. And we believe that we can play a significant role in infrastructure financing and uh, also AFC joined to the uh, uh, infrastructure financing uh, initiative, which was done by the uh, Central Bank of uh, Hong Kong. So that's the, the sort of skeleton of the whole thing. But what about actually putting sort of uh, meat on the bones, as it were? Do you see actual projects actually happening along the Belt and Road through, through your country? Yes, absolutely. I think here I can mention two issues. It's a huge, massive privatization going to happen in Kazakhstan. Uh, it's a companies which are very much related uh, to, the, uh, to the export to China, like oil and gas, uranium, also infrastructure companies like railways, electricity grid, uh, from one side. And from the other side, I think it's a big uh, infrastructure, uh, construction like energy infrastructure, transport infrastructure, the, all of this process already ongoing. We expect also to bring more private sector from Hong Kong, like different uh, private wealth management uh, companies, different uh, asset managers. So how much interest have you had in the Astana International Financial Center here at the Asian Financial Forum? I think it's a big interest to um, One Belt, One Road uh, initiative itself uh, in general, but in particular programs where people are very much interested, particularly projects, which is road constructions, which is a railways construction, and uh, I think this uh, time we have the opportunities to present the investment opportunities in our country. And I think it's a good beginning of our cooperation. <laughs>